Hey. hey guys, welcome back to the Wandering Wind. Today we are going to be getting started with the second act of the Chapter 1 Archon Quest titled Farewell Archaic Lord. Um, I'm really excited to get started with this and maybe, maybe get to Adventure Rank 30 before the end of this quest line. Who knows? Anyway, right now I got to go talk to the bank staff at Northland Bank. So let's go do that. Welcome, friend of child, and congratulations on the first day of your illustrious career with the Fatui. I have no intention of joining. You sound remarkably sure of yourself. Remember, hmm. we are mere mortals. Our ideas are fluid like water. Yeah, 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 whatever. Child tells me that he has upheld his end of your agreement. Oh, he has. Oh, the thing about him helping us find a god? Yep. Correct. Child promised he would find someone to break the stalemate. And the harbingers do not, do not break their promises place. lightly. Wow. Yep. Where is that guy? Any child is currently at Leoli Pavilion. Ah, oh, restaurant. Oh, ahem. There are two Shoot. styles of cooking in Leoli. Known as Lee style? In the U.S. style. Huh. The flagship restaurant of the Lee style is the Leonie Pavilion. The owner especially chose to open the restaurant at Feiyun's Grove so they could compete face-to-face -face <laughs> with the Shinue Kiosk, which is the flagship restaurant of the U.S. style. Uh, you're like this every time we talk about food, Paimon. Don't talk to Paimon like that. <laughs> anyway, Paimon's hungry. Let's get moving. Yay. Time to start the second act. Farewell, Archaic Lord. Finding Child. Oh. Is he higher up, like up here? Or? No, we already got that. Okay. All right. Mr. Chi, huh? All right. Leave Northland Bank. Got it. And then... Go to the Leo Lee Pavilion. Right down here, huh? Okay. Yeah. Aha, uh -huh, you made it. Aha, uh -huh, you made it. As promised, I have found someone who can help you. Someone, someone who can solve the mystery by you. Sheila Chi Sing would hide the Geo Archon's best friend. Why would they? Oh, where is he? He certainly is. Come, I'll introduce you. I took the okay. liberty of setting up a business dinner, as per the Leo custom. Awesome. Business dinner. Let's see. Welcome back, sir. You honor, honor us with your patronage. Mr. Zhongli is awaiting your arrival in the Linyu book. <laughs> Zhongli, yes. Here comes Geo Daddy. I mean, well, I mean, that's what they call him anyway. <laughs> To be fair, he is very much an interesting person. Especially when you find out who he is. I'm not spoiling it, but... Allow me to introduce Mr. Zhong Li, consultant to an organization known as Wang Sheng, and a trusted associate of the Fatui. Uh-oh. Indeed, Wang Sheng's line of work can be sensitive at times. Let's just say they understand when discretion is needed. Uh oh, discretion. Been glad to do business with friends who walk in the shadows. Walk in the shadows. Uh oh. Shadows? Are they assassins? It is an honor to meet you. <laughs> I have heard tell of you from Mondstadt. Hopefully, good things, right? Shadows. <laughs> Just bury people. <laughs> Did you think he was some sort of hired killer? Well, what the Fatui? Who knows? People friends, but the Wang Sheng funeral parlor <laughs> does not dabble in such business. Well, ostensibly. Ostensibly. Well, what you saying? Well, they are still. Uh, I 
shouldn't say too much. In any case, I brought you to meet Mr. Zheng Li because... Because I... Bring, bring you to see... You to see Rex Lapis's vessel. Ooh. We can see the Exuvia thanks Don't to you. Don't be so surprised. Sure, the Geo Archon's body has been squirreled away by order of the Tian Chuan Ning Guang. But first, let's hear what Mr. Zheng Li has to say, shall we? Rex okay. Rex Lapis may be the prime of Adepti. But he's ultimately an Adeptus. Many Adepti have left us over the millennia. Oof. This is the inexorable trend. The times eh. have changed. You must have felt it too when you were at Jueyun Cart. That's true. The Adepti are staying away from me. But... As you have seen, the time of the Adepti is ending. And the time of mankind is slowly dawning. In years past, Liu's tradition was that a huge memorial service be held to mark the passing of every Adeptus. But this time, mm. the Qixing have made no attempt whatsoever to respect this tradition. It is sacrilege. Well, I mean, they do have a killing to deal with. Yeah, the killer hasn't even been caught yet. Be aside or not, the concern of the Wangsheng funeral parlor is this. When the ritual to receive this god is so kingly, it is all the more egregious for his final send-off to go unattended to. Oof. Yeah, but true. Child has told me a lot about you. Since you have had dealings with the Animo Archon, mm. could I ask you to help me prepare the Geo Archon's last rites? I accept your invitation, but Child says too much, man. decision. The Tian Chuan Ning Wang has forbidden anyone from accessing Rex Lapis's vessel, which of course you would need to access if you were to achieve your goal of meeting all of the seven. Precisely. Uh. Only by participating in the <laughs> rite of parting will you be able to see the form of Rex Lapis again. That's why we don't have a choice. If we are agreed, come with me. We will speak of the details as we walk. Excellent. My bridge building work here is done. Turned out well, didn't it? Sure did. If you want to, don't worry about me. All right, I'm going then. Not even gonna wait for you to stop talking because you talk too long. Leave. Leaving, leaving, leaving. Ah, here's the prime of Adepti himself. Ah, darn, I already gave it away. Yeah, he's Rex Lapis. <laughs> After having experienced the land of the absentee Archon, Traveler, how does it feel to know that our Archon and Adepti are here all around you in Liyue? I prefer Mondstadt, honestly. <laughs> I see. Mm -hmm. So you're that sort of person. It's not a bad thing. Right. But I suppose you have yet to experience the substance of Liyue's 3,700 years. years of divinity. Ooh, 3,700. Party should prove to be an enlightening part of your travels. Indeed, Liu indeed. The most prosperous of the seven nations, defended by deities and ruled by the Qixing. As such, the diplomatic <laughs> maneuverings of the Fatui have gained no purchase here. No purchase. The of the Qixing has always been on her guard against the Fatui. That is in all likelihood why Chai <coughs> wants to be the <coughs> of the Wangsheng funeral parlor's connections. You know, the one thing that I like about this game is how much it explains things, but it does so in a way that really lends itself to not being too much of a slog. But still, it, it, is, it is a little bit more hmm, slow-paced in some areas, especially with its... Um, provided. If you I guess you can go to him to apply for any it's subsequent funding. Request. Wow. Yeah. Well then, let us be off. Mm -hmm. The first step in our preparation shall be to obtain some prize Noctilucus Jade worthy of a deity. Noctilucus Jade, okay. Try on like betting on Jade. Okay. Keep going and go see. What's his name? Cheeto. Yep, that's it. Welcome to the Jade 
history, my good friends. Would you like to try your luck betting on Jade? This could be your lucky day. Yeah. It's cheap and it's fun, and who knows? You just might strike it rich. Betty? No. Nocta Lucas Jade of radiant grade at the very least. Radiant grade? Grade Nocta Lucas Jade? I see. You're not a tourist. My apologies. Mm. What do you think? The Jade Mystery is an old name in the Jade business. Just look at that wonderful quality. <laughs> Rex Lapis doesn't often bless us with such finery. Go on, pick whichever one you like. Mm. This is really put out of repeat. Should we just grab one and go? Uh, what do you think, Zhongling? You want me? If it were me, the a oh? and I'll take them all, boss. Okay. <laughs> oh, you act with such panache. Okay, oh, then. <laughs> hey, if we only need one for the ritual, are we wasting Actually, three it's... times the more if we buy them all? It's two times more more. Oh, it is as you say. <laughs> I suppose I overlooked this particular aspect of the transaction. <laughs> oh, good lord. If one must always consider Mora before acting, then in all things one is bound by Mora. Well, it's kind of the... the, 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 the... All Mora is currency, but not all currency is Mora. Mm. He's talking about economics. Savings true me to waver, even when I am constrained by Mora. I have <laughs> ways of working around my limitations, mainly by now, using other people's Mora money. Nocta Lucas Jade is indeed very tricky. As crude ore, there is little difference in texture, lustrousness, and internal pattern between good and bad jade. Mm. Only after the item made using Nocta Lucas Jade has taken shape. Will you be able to see whether it is up to par or not? Oof. If you return to those crafty merchants to quibble, they will counter by saying that your crafting bench is to blame, or that your heat control was poor. Mm. But there is a way to truly evaluate this jade, and a true insider would know it. Thankfully, you know, right? Sees the pointer and misses the moon. Mm. What is that? If you point at the moon with your finger. A wise man knows that you are pointing at the moon, while a fool will only see the finger. Mm. Patterns, the facade, these are all the finger. Not to Lucas J. <laughs> is a mystical stone used to light up the darkness, and so its brightness is the important thing. It is the moon. It is the moon. Ah. Not to Lucas J. of X. Wonder if he doesn't know anything about this. Probably. In other words, the bluer and brighter the luster of the ore under high temperature, the higher its quality. Is this normal life for a high class I gentleman? Parted the priceless secrets of the jade <laughs> trade to you. Now all that's left is to put, put it, it into practice. practice huh? Hmm. So what do we do? Go back to buy some rocks, boss. But can you uh, burn them? You can't do that, my friends. If you <laughs> were to do so, what? All right, then can we get some small samples? Well, how about this? I can take a small sample of all three. I'll take a bit of a loss. We'll count it as a friendly gesture. Don't awesome. worry. I know the rules. <laughs> as long as we can prove that it is good jade, you will not take a loss. Excellent. Now... All right, take these as samples. I've carved them off with a knife and tagged them to boot. So thin. Even a bug's wings are thicker. These are almost see through. <laughs> this is impressive handiwork. <laughs> oh, you flatter me, but I have to be gentle with these rocks. They are my pride and joy. If I'd taken off even a bit more, it <laughs> it would have killed me. But <laughs> wouldn't something this thin go poof if we held it to the It can't be helped. Trying to deprive <sighs> a merchant of his profits would be like forcing a ravenous wolf to vomit up the food in its stomach. Nonetheless, under the right conditions, these thin slices will serve. What? Mm. While we add the high temperatures using pyro, we can use hydro to reinforce it from within. 
This way, the samples will not disintegrate immediately. <sighs> oh, strictly speaking, <laughs> asking for samples when we have not yet agreed to purchase the goods is unfair. Trade in lira must be based upon fairness. Dang, Zhang Li's good. Ah. How about Zhang Ling's kitchen? That would not do. It is a place where people come and go. Mm. Oh, Simon remembers. We ah, darn it. Big park down at the Data Upa Gorge in the camp of the hilly trolls from the Meaty Tribe. It's real sturdy and should be able to take the elemental reaction. All righty, let's go. The Data Upa Gorge. Yeah. Go to Mondstadt. Yep. I'm going over, not around. Thanks. There we go. It has been a long time since I last set foot in the nation of Zing. A Good. friend of mine from Mondstadt would always bring a few bottles of locally brewed dandelion wine whenever he came to visit me in Lira. Right. <laughs> it must be said that the famed liquor of the land of Pastoris is far better than Sumeru's frigid snake wine. <laughs> ah, Sumeru's got wine too. Never knew. Now I do. And there it is, Dada Uva Gorge. And with it, the pot. The park. Ah, it looks like the hilly trolls are still using it. All right, time to just. Okay. Here we go. Excellent. Here we go. There's no soup in the air. These hilly trolls sure have big appetites. Well, it's our lab now. This soup looks like it could be used as our hydro elemental protection. Let's fire it up and begin our experiment. Excellent. Okay. We'll use pyro to keep making the pot hotter until we get the results we need. Excellent. Mr. Zhang said that the shinier and bluer the ore gets, the better it is. So, pay close attention. Excellent. Will do. Pyro. Hilly trolls are surrounding us again. Were they attracted by the light? Such Probably. Neighbors. Let's take care of them and continue with their master. Here we go. All right. Okay. That light came from the second note to Lucas J. Didn't okay. it? More hilly trolls. They don't give up, do they? Nope. Not at all. Looks like they're mad that we ruined their food. <laughs> On member. Excellent. All righty, one more. Oh, that's bright. Too bright. Okay, the third one is the one. The third was it? Yep. It was so much shinier than the rest. Let's go with that one. All right, let's go.
Try your luck betting on Jade? No, I'm not gonna bet. I'm gonna actually win. <laughs> You're back, my friends. I've got a third. No problem. If you have then we'll take a buck. Done. All the same. <laughs> pardon me for asking, but I suppose it would not hurt to tell you. <laughs> we need them to make implements for the right of pardon. <sighs> Oh dear. I'd heard the rumors but had given much thought to them. This this means that Rex Lapis really is Yep. Oh, that's hard to believe. Even though the Jade Mystery has been in decline, we have always been under his protection. It is said yep. that when our Lord lost his way while going incognito in the city two hundred years ago, it was a spoon from the Jade Mystery. That he had used to sample the local delights. Ah. Alas, alas, all things must pass. <laughs> <sighs> well, alas, alas, all things must pass. Say farewell to Rex Lapis. And so the order goes. I shall sell this to you at half the price. Are you sure you didn't want to even give us an inch before? If not for our Lord's protection, this city wouldn't exist as it does now. No proprietor can earn money off such a thing. <laughs> In the safe hands of the Liu Achijin and good, honest merchants such as yourself, I for <laughs> one believe that Liu e will continue to prosper as it always has done. Yep. All right. Thank you, my friends. <laughs> What's with me getting all sentimental like this? I'll practically be giving away all my fortune at this rate. <laughs> now that we've made our choice, Let's take this Noctilucus Jade back. All right, let's take it back. Where? He said it was half price. Not that we could leave without. Oh, right. I'm sorry. As I thought, I. Any what? Mora. My apologies. <laughs> Another oversight on my. All righty. A local of Leeway who doesn't have money on their mind. Whatever surprise. Oh, won't do. This is I have them on me. enough for half price <laughs> though to be honest it'd be all right even if the... <laughs> well it's settled then let's take this jade to eugene terrace that's where we plan to hold the riot don't you keep bossing everyone around you didn't cough up a single more <sighs> guess we need to find child for more funding it seems that <laughs> all right uh, really i haven't gotten that down part point yet Ah, well, I'll get that one next. <laughs> oh, I'll make it a point to climb up there and get that one. Just so that way it's already done. <clears throat> Alrighty. Ooh, we're going to be able to get to meet Chi Chi, I'm sure. I think this is the part where we get to meet her. She's so adorable and cute. And honestly, one of the best um, five-star characters on the standard banner, in my opinion. Even better than Dia. I mean, Dia isn't bad for what she is. But it'd be better if she could actually be, I don't know, worth being a five star i don't know it just seems kind of silly to me that she's a five star character and yes he's not even worth it okay all right and place down the knock to lucas jade excellent we can leave the jade here <coughs> i have already called for a mm. Uh, yes, I have yet to go and see child. So, as for the jewel smith's remuneration, <laughs> fingers crossed, child will help. We can't do anything else. I'll... Yes, I have already rented this location and have begun making preparations for the right. Uh, we're just using the scene of the crime. Thing have agreed to this arrangement. Well, when uh. something big here, she <laughs> Soldiers have come shifting after us. I wonder what that's about. 
I'm pretty sure we probably... Traditionally, we call it the Exuvia. <laughs> One must think that they already have someone in mind. Mm. Or perhaps they already know. Surely they must have found all the evidence that there is to find here. Still feels very odd. These things are for the authorities in Eugene Terrace to consider. Trying to help would probably only add to their troubles. Yeah, true, the true. Is conducted, the Exuvia will be kept temporarily in the Golden House. The Golden House. We only mint in Lyra. Which is to say, the only mint into that. Mm. All the more that flows throughout the world is minted there. Uh oh. Oh, no! Slime, I wasn't thinking <laughs> about anything bad. Slime, I'm thinking this is for us. Yeah, sir. Why do you know this, Sister Zhongli? Since the rite of parting has the approval of the Chieftain, <laughs> it is a semi official event. As such, there is already some limited information available. Chieftain provides. No location, child the funds. Hmm, ulterior motive. Has their motives. But this is the capital of commerce. A little exploitation once in a while is not unacceptable. <laughs> right. In Lyra, where the god of contract reigns, only contracts may not be betrayed. Mm. I, for one, have no issue with little maneuvers outside their remit. Uh. Well, then, we should go and prepare the perfumes used in the rite. Perfumes. Okay. No. Perfumes used to honor the gods must be freshly decocted. Mm. The quality of the silk flowers we require is also special. Silk okay. flower petals contain a fibrous material of good quality, often used in brocade making. Mm. Its scent, however, is most elegant. Most elegant. Suited for solemn events, for <laughs> giving offerings to gods and adepti. Ah. I know, right? This is the most boring <laughs> in part. We shall go to the merchants to purchase our ingredients. All right, then let's go then. Oh wait, hey, yeah, well, I might be able to get through this part before <laughs> my forty-five minute cutoff time. I doubt it, but maybe. Okay. Go and go down. Wait, there. Okay. I'll wait. Oh yeah, there is a bottom part. Okay. Don't lie. Hey boss, do you sell silk flowers? Silk flowers? Okay. Golden house <laughs> maiden, valley weaver, and fate's yearning. Huh. My goodness, this gentleman is quite the connoisseur. You two nice. must be his servants. Please refer <laughs> to any further attempts to contribute. Okay, guess I had it coming. Now then, please peruse at your leisure. Do let me know if you have any further thoughts. Silk yep. flowers exhibit different properties based on how their environmental conditions differ from <laughs> ancestral habitat. <laughs> Nevertheless, these are fine specimens. Excellently Excellent. preserved. Just look at the abundant foliage here. And these mm. stamens, glamorous as a maiden of the golden house. Yeah, 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 yeah. This variety. Lastly, this strange... Blah, 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 blah. Possessed by a <laughs> smattering of trivial knowledge. My traveler. I'm, I'm still an ignoramus on horticulture. I'll take them all. Again? How can I put this? <laughs> when purchasing opera tickets, it is natural to discuss. But this silk flower purchase is not an analogous case. Perhaps you don't know. Tradition states that uh. we should decoct perfume from different subspecies of silk flower, when, like several other tedious and complicated <laughs> traditions, but this is the only rite of parting to take place for one of the seven in 3,700 years. Uh. Uh, now, that's said. You forgot to bring money again? By this point, I'd be more surprised if he'd remembered. If I may interject. Uh. Gosh, well, it would be bad. All right, blah, blah, blah. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm just going to be going through these. Ideally, with the help Hence, I need I will wait for you near the statue. That's it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll go see Elon. Uh, needless to say, I'm probably just going to be skipping over the majority of these uh, dialogue sessions as they were. You know how to make perfume. <laughs> now that you mention it, oh, it must be from the Chingshin flowers I picked on the way back. <laughs> the truth is, uh, no, they were from the. Anyway, this is a pointless conversation. You you mean... Fortune teller, right? Thanks, Lon. All right. Go see Chiming. She's out at the docks, right? Okay. Booba first. No. I need to get the viewpoint. Excellent. Adding to my collection. Hello. We've come to ask you a question. You know how to make perfume. Perfume? That said, some of the since I usually set up my stall by the docks, I avoid purging mm. like the plague. As Celestia forbid those lusty <coughs> sailors catch a whiff and come hunting for the soul. Lastly, what while we're on the subject? Yeah. Yes, yep. Ah. Sure. Uh, Yingar. Are... Oh, good, 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 good. She's actually there. That's wonderful. I thought she'd still be in Mon's hat. Good thing she's not. <laughs> Actually, I was starting to worry you wouldn't find me. <laughs> what can I say? Pe Relax. I know why you're here. You want to get your hand on my homemade perfume, don't you? What Whichever one you you're wearing. <laughs> How could it be that you <laughs> can be with... <sighs> Whatever they say. Three in one go. You have extreme tastes for someone <laughs> your age. Ma uh, is that the best you... Zhang Lee was right. As one of my favorite poems goes. Rambling over pot... <laughs> In short, so where is a good place for you mean one me? Let's go to the kitchen. Yay. We're almost there. Chef Ma, are you ready? What did you say? Oh, God. I'm it's another one. As my well, I'm setting up. <laughs> Fetch some water from where? Oh. What the? Oh, is there a water thing in back? Wouldn't be surprised at all. Draw some water. Ooh, Legend of the Lone Sword. I have yet to actually read any of these books, but I've wanted to. <laughs> I'd like to buy a snack. And some more meat. Yay. Yep, always good to have more meat. Ying R. Now, I need you to explain. Perfume making uses an altogether different technique from alchemy. Here, let me teach you. Very carefully, take hold of the... You need to keep your whiff now. Use your strong... Oh, God. I get it. I get it. I get it. Now, take the... Don't forget to do... God. I keep forgetting how badly... How thirsty some of them... <laughs> it's yearning. Okay. Okay, all righty then. We've got all three. Yay. So that's to be. <clears throat> wow. Talk to this, the essence is 
placed into water and is simmered over a low heat. You must take care, so please don't waste a drop. Don't wait a, waste a drop, okay? I won't. All three perfumes are a testament to the lengths you will go to for romance. <sighs> it's so rare to see nowadays. Yeah, yeah, I was thinking of you the whole time. Right. Wow, you, you know, you're cuter than people give you credit for. Anyway, Diana wants to hear this first one. The second one, finally, <laughs> all clear? Don't get them mixed I think up. I got it. I'll leave you with one who tries to sail three boats simultaneously. Should be careful not to go overboard. What? What? Oh my god. <laughs> Come and hang out with <laughs> me at Sense of Spring sometime. <laughs> oh, good morning. Let's take these three perfumes over to the Sancho Vincentes. Yeah, Zhang Li's probably been waiting a while. And while he's been doing that, he's been going, how do I make sure that there's a reaction without it being so obvious that it's me? We brought the perfumes. Did we take too long? Hmm. Oh, compared to the watch that Rex Lapis's statues have kept over Lila, this was but a brief moment. <laughs> <laughs> well, how that is true. Three sets. <sighs> Thank you both. Let us offer them up. Okay. This is the first kind of perfume. Miss Ying knows that this is the second kind. It's the third kind has a gentle but lingering fragrance. Something, something like the death snake. And it's a favorite. Aha, <laughs> there we go. Oh, what really? Is that? Looks like Rex, Rex Lapis really likes it's old lady perfume. Perhaps, perhaps. Perhaps Rex Lapis has taken on countless. What a shame. <sighs> we can leave that to mm -hmm. the authorities. Let us focus on the farm yeah. for Rex Lapis. Yeah. So, we finished. Next, I would like the cleansing. Guide. At present, a friend of mine named Madame Ping is the guardian of the cleansing bed. <laughs> she lives near you. Madame Yen. Ping. Sure, but. Ah, I have. The reason why you can't be there in person is because, um, well, Madam Ping knows who he really is, and if he were to show his face, she'd be very cross with him for a, a number of reasons, mainly, but ultimately for the reason of, really? You just up and left without even telling us, really? You're ridiculously just... <laughs> So yes, we're uh, none too happy with him over leaving his friends high and dry and like that. I guess I know I said I would get the... Oh, I can't pick him yet? Dang it, figures. All things must... Hmm, youngster, are you here to admire... What happened? Back in my day, people said the click if they fast. So that mm. means you. Yes, the root. Some say it was a patchouli plot. This hard mm. is like a mountain of dried. Well, I shall say no. We'd like to borrow something from you. Borrow some, but it was not originally mine. It, I uh. had a vein hit me when I was young and. I would pester him for that bell all the time. He could not dissuade me. And so he gave. It has been many years, <laughs> and still, though, I oh, these old bones are so slow to look for things. I don't You're look for it. And, uh, all right, children, there is no. Uh, do you live? <laughs> <laughs> An old lady like me can't afford to buy a place in this city. <laughs> this ceramic teapot. Okay. The bell is all you own. In you go, Paimon. There's no way Paimon would say. And why do you <laughs> Oh, youngsters. I. Okay, well. 
Let's go. Let's reach in and, and grab the bell because it can't be far in. Wait, what? What? Uh, what's happening? Where am I going? Why am I going? Is this an adept eye thing? Oh gosh, it's an adept eye thing in it. Oh wait, I remember. Never mind. Youngsters, this is where this old woman keeps all her things. Quickly now, go fetch that bell. Yep. Oh dear. So many cobwebs. <laughs> it seems I really haven't cleaned it in a long while. Yep. Sorry to trouble you, children. Please help an old lady clean up. Sir, I can do that. There we go. Excellent. All right. Now we have but to go up. No tests. Okay. All right. Jump. Fly. Excellent. Keep going. You know, with such a special teapot and the cleansing bells, do you think this old granny could also be an adeptus? Oh, she probably is. She definitely is. She definitely is. Not all of them. Because she's bored of being out in the boonies. And maybe also because she mourns a friend and uh, basically Guizhong, the uh, adeptus that was friends with Cloud Retainer and Rex Lapis, died in the war that happened a while back, the Archon War. And because she died, it broke a lot of the Ar the Adeptized hearts, including Cloud Retainer, who at the time was all was also known as Sweet Street Word Rambler, I think. Something like that. Anyway. She was unfortunately very close with Guizhong. Side can be difficult. Oh, there we go. There is the bell. The cleansing bell. Oh, you found it. <laughs> Youngsters are so quick on their feet. Now, let me see. 
How did this opening work again? All right, that'll do. <laughs> Come on out now, children. Yep. Yay, time to go out. And that will be the end of the next part of the quest after this cutscene here. <sighs> oh, in and out in no time. You youngsters really are quick. Are you an adeptus, man? As to whether I am one or not, child. <laughs> I'm a being that knows what you mean. But it's also don't you think it's weird? Oh, don't be silly. Mm -hmm. Mira Harva has been through a great deal in this history. In that time it has seen the departure of countless adepti. But no matter mm. what, we have always performed the rite of parting first before any other matter. To cry, mm. catch the murderers at the top of one's lungs, but ignore the rite of parting. That's the move. What is wrong-headed? Mm. So now that you have come to borrow the bell, I guess that perhaps an old friend of mine has finally decided to take matters into their own hands. Yep, he has. Why would I be unwilling to lend you the bell? Oh? Well, if it came to that, <laughs> they would find a certain, certain old lady, lady knocking at their door. If we haven't met in a while anyway, it <laughs> would be nice to share a drink and chat. Yep. Well, you must have things to do. Since you have the bell, you should return. Oh, yep. and do tell the person who sent you that... If they have time, they can come over <laughs> for tea. I don't have much to offer, but you can always count on an old <laughs> lady for a pot of tea. We yep. will. <laughs> it's bigger on the inside. Doctor Who reference. Yay. <laughs> Excellent. How many more until we get? Oh, I can get another one right now. Okay. 28 out of 30. And now I can pick the. Let's just hope. And now I can pick the. <laughs> Blaze Lilies without fear. And I can pick as many as I want. And the silk flowers, which are useful for many things. But really, I picked the glaze lilies because they're useful for certain characters' ascensions. All right, grab all the glaze lilies. And now, go place the perfume and cleansing bell where they need to go. And then that will end this particular part of the playthrough. Part one of the Rite of Dissension. Farewell, Archaic Lord. Actually, I'll go ahead and leave it here, and I will pick up again with the next part in the following video. Have a good night, guys. See you later. Bye.